Are you dealing with an expired listing here in Tucson? I can help you with a fast, fair, and simple offer. Let's talk today about what we can do to help you with your expired listing here in Tucson. Hi, my name is Carl Krenzel. I'm the broker over here at Carl Buys Houses. And for a homeowner who wants to just sell their property in Tucson, dealing with an expired listing can be an incredibly frustrating experience. I mean, you put time and money into working with an agent only to find yourself back at square one several months later. If you want to sell, I mean, you likely had a reason why. The house might be too big, it might be too small, or maybe it's just not in the location that you'd prefer. You might be dealing with something a little bit more difficult, such as an inability to pay the mortgage, high property taxes, or, or just tenants you're tired of dealing with. When you just want to sell your property once and for all, but the listing expires, here's what you can do next. Option one, you could always list it again. If you've got a listing in Tucson that expires, uh, that's expired, you can always change things up and try again. You can work with a new listing agent who can maybe have a different approach than your first one did. You can hire a professional photographer who will help showcase the property maybe in a different way. And if you're not opposed to spending a little bit of money up front, you might want to make a couple upgrades to the things that your previous buyers had found off-putting in the past. After waiting months for a buyer only to find yourself back at square one, I, I can recognize that doing it all over again may not sound appealing. But lucky for you, there's other options. Option number two, you could always rent it out. If you have an expired listing here in Tucson, it may not be the right time, actually, for you to sell your house. Before you commit to another listing agreement, check out the rental market here in your area. How much are properties renting out for? What are the vacancy rates looks like? Is the area walkable? Is it desired by renters? Understand that not everybody wants to be a landlord, so only choose this option if it's something that you want to handle and you want to do. If you want, you could also consider hiring a property management company to help you. Now, again, their rates are negotiable, but they typically charge anywhere from 10% or so of the monthly rent. And of course, this depends by company and location. You can always rent out your property for a year or two if you don't need the cash right away. Then you can check out the real estate market down the road and hopefully you'll have a better chance to sell. Third, you could always try owner financing. Now, if your agent had, hadn't uh, maybe recommended this to you, this is something you definitely want to consider. There's a lot of people out there who want to buy a home but one, creme, you know, one blemish on their financial history is holding them back. Maybe they've uh, had experienced, a, I don't know, identity fraud, which dropped their credit score. Maybe, I don't know, they were uh, forced to use the money that they had been saving for a down payment on a sudden expense. Maybe they had their home lost in a, in a foreclosure back in the day. I, I don't know. There's always a lot of great uh, financially responsible people who would love the opportunity to, have, uh, to become a homeowner and by offering them owner financing, you're going to be able to sell your house for the asking price while helping someone to achieve their dream of finally owning a home here in Tucson. This works for homeowners who don't require their full amount of sale up front. These agreements typically last for two years, at which time the buyer should be able to qualify for traditional financing, paying you the property in full. Of course, next you could sell it directly. Selling your house directly to a professional home buyer such as Carl Buys Houses will allow you to quickly sell your house without further costs or waiting. You'll experience a straightforward and hassle-free selling experience that you will understand that will provide you uh, with the proceeds you need almost instantaneously. Best of all, you won't have to pay any commissions. There's no fees. There's no agent fees which are going to eat away at your profit from a traditional property sale. My process won't cost you anything and it'll put money in your pocket right away. Of course, finally, you could wait. While it may not be the answer you're hoping for, sometimes it's best actually just to sit back and wait until the market improves in your area. The trouble with waiting is that sometimes you're likely missing out on another opportunity that could have been even bigger than the one you have now. You may have to continue living in a house that doesn't match your needs or your lifestyle, and that's not fun for anybody. If you've got an expired listing here in Tucson, reach out to me today to find out how I can help. Will I make a fair and a direct offer on your home here in Tucson in the surrounding area, and I'll help you finally sell your unwanted house so you can move on with the rest of your life. Get help with your expired listing here in Tucson. Reach out to me today. 
Call me at 520-403-6227 to find a solution that works. And as always, I hope you have a powerful sales day. Bye-bye.